Hello everyone, this is Harshmit Singh from the Root My Android YouTube channel and today in this tutorial we'll be rooting your Android device. In this tutorial we'll be using the Kingo root application for Windows that will be running on a Windows PC and let's just get ahead and download it. Don't worry, the links will be provided in the description for the downloads and as you can see the download has already started in the right side of my browser. So the next thing you need to make sure is that you have the USB ADB drivers for your Android device installed on your PC. So if you have them installed, no worries, but if not, just log on to downloadandroiddrivers.com and go to the brand section right here and just get to your device or even though you can search your device model number right here. And again, don't worry, the links will be provided in the description. The next point of business right now is to get the USB debugging enabled on your Android device. In order to do that, let's get to the settings of your Android device, scroll down to the bottom and go to developer options. In case you don't see developer options, just google it how to enable developer options and you'll have them right here. So just make sure you have this section right here, USB debugging enabled and with a tick right here. So as my device is enabled right now, we'll go to home. So let's install the Kingaroot application we just downloaded right now. Let's double click on it, run and let's give him administrative access. Just decline these two extensions for your Chrome, I guess. So after the installation has completed, just click on finish, launch the application on exit and close. So as you can see now the application has uh, loaded and it's, it's also asking us to enable USB debugging mode which we already did earlier. And let's see what happens now. So as the application has launched, it gives us a root button right here. So let's just click on it. And uh, the application is doing its work. And as you can see on my device, my device is also getting something. Uh, so you can see right here, uh, the application is writing some stuff right here which you can read and just tell that the application is doing something on your device and uh, which is uh, practically a little safe uh, rather than using an android application or something So as you can see the device has rooted itself and it, it shows on my screen and also on the Kangaroo application. I think this was a success. So let's just close the Kangaroo application. So let's go to the home page and go to our browser right now. So the next thing you want to do after rooting a device is just go on and install the application from the Play Store by just clicking here and just confirm your root access so i have installed this right now on my device so i will just go down there let's go to the home page let's click on application let's open the app that's the root checker pro app from root my android and after you open this app and there's just this little nifty button right here that says verify root you can just click on it and let it do its job and you can see the device is rooted it says the device is rooted also, if you have BusyBox installed, you can also check the BusyBox. Well, of course, for a first time router, this is not a thing to check. Well, also in this app, you can go to some nifty root basics tutorials right here. Also, you can read some feature tutorials that you can do with your device after you gain the root access. If you like the application, you can just click on, you can just share with your friends, the radar app on Google Play Store, which already has five star rating. So after checking the root access with the root checker pro, you can also log on to our website rootmyandroid.org. The link will also be provided in the description and go to the featured section. In this section, we, will have, we have tons of tutorials like uh, how to increase RAM, how to increase internal memory, how to uh, download paid games for Google Play itself. Also, you can get in-app purchases without purchasing or giving a single penny to Google Play by reading this tutorial right here. And there are a ton more. So that was it guys, this was Hershmi Singh signing off from Root My Android and you just learned how to root your Android device 
you can like this video and also share and also comment if you like this video if you have any queries just go on to rootminder.org and go to contact us and tell us what where are you facing any issues and we'll get back to you as soon as possible